try to clean some of the oh yeah I don't think this is gonna work out very well from the area that I can reach it at that is bad all that is pretty gross but I mean what else are you gonna do might as well have it free flow out instead of being sucked up by emissions equipment so there we go we're ready to go it's probably gonna be way too loud but I'll, I'll uh, move once it starts up so let's do this <laughs> Oh, this is going to be loud, man. <laughs> also louder in the cab, but damn, that smell is a lot different now. Oh. That just does not sound, oh my goodness, that sounds so weird. Alright, let's slow this, this up. Oh my goodness. Well, it's about time for the fish to wake up anyway. Oh, I think I left my weed whacker on. Big hill, big hill, big hill, big hill. guys pulling out here just went to the gym got a good workout in a protein bar man and then also ran so let's head on out to the road I am really debating about heading on the highway to get there it'll make things a lot quicker although this thing is so loud that that may not be a good idea but I think we might do it anyway <laughs> this thing is a damn weed whacker Ooh, we had to make a sharp turn to the left because I'm heading to US 15 South <laughs> Well, like a wise man once said, here goes nothing. Oh my gosh, what the fuck? Holy... Whoa! Oh my gosh. Oh! today let's see if we can get everything accomplished five inch exhaust Start her up. 
Oh wow. Honestly, so much exhaust. Spray pipe. Spray pipe all the way back, man. All the way back. Still gotta get that well on. That sounds good. Sure sounds like a truck again. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love the tone of this actually. This sounds honestly, honestly, right now this sounds better than the no exhaust easily. And this definitely sounds better than just that downpipe. Everything was shaking and rumbling in here and it was driving me nuts. This is so much nicer. Oh yeah, that sounds so much better. I'm finally finally glad that I got that exhaust on, man. That sounds so good. I honestly thought I was going to quiet it or make the tone just a little bit, just not as good as just the downpipe, but wow, what was I wrong. Plus, that was a cat. It was a four-inch downpipe with the cat from the stock exhaust, and this is so much better. Oh my gosh. Let's get these windows down. Old Ford, man. Old Ford. can hear the turbo more I was missing out so much I was missing out on everything here we go here we go I listened to the clips yesterday when I was running no exhaust the microphone was not doing justice on this at all and this is actually a quality microphone too it sounds so much better so you're probably missing out on a lot of sound right now but it sounds so good Right there, did you hear that? Oh. I'm probably gonna be trading in my Cummins for a Maserati. BMW, Mercedes, I can't handle it. There we go, Falconer Ram. Oh, they got the new Rams out now, the new body style. Huh? Just saw the 2018s on the lot. Too bad they don't have the Eco D. Oh, you can just hear that pipe rumbling right now. Oh, yes. Oh, my gosh. Hell yeah. Another 2019 Laramie. Ooh. There's one right now. Holy moly. It's definitely different, man. It sits low, low. This thing's sitting low now, but I do like everything's going on in the bumper. I mean, they look so much different. It kind of reminds me almost like a, like a Chevy Colorado, but made into a full size, which I'm sure this is good. 2019 Silverado is pretty close to looking to this. They're all getting pretty similar. I mean, uh, yeah. 1500 Hemi. So they start doing this. Uh, I never noticed that. that. Wow, that's like a black metallic paint. Sick. Got the Ram badge down there. Let's see these interiors now. Oh, they really upgraded. Yep. Ram has never changed their interiors, but now they look sweet. Rims don't look too bad either. Spray and bed liner. Look at that, it's got like a flat third brake light on it. That's weird. That is cool. I love these taillights. Although, this is not even clear. If you see this, this is actually like a red paint. I don't know if that lights up or not. Look how big that, they really made the badge big on these. Big horn. 
just kind of molded the word into all one word I see there. So this is a button now I see. It's cool. So uh, dual exhaust. Never really was the fan of the exhaust that kind of arched into the bumper like that. But whatever. Those are actually cool sensors. Let's see what it looks like. This is so like I have to get down low to get under here. That piping is so small. I put my whole hand around it. So yeah, they made some changes. I like the doors. The doors remind me of the Silverado doors with the nice fold to it down there. 51 grand, 2019 model. Your Ram 1500 Bighorn, base price 41. It's cool, man. It's got the 5.7. It's got an eight-speed auto in it. 3.21 rear axle ratio. I'm loving the seats. I'm digging those. It kind of reminds me of one of those socks that you'd wear in a cabin on a cold winter day. Looks like it'd be pretty warm, but for right now, I'd actually want whatever's the coolest. It's hot outside. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, man. You got to be kidding me. It's literally a knob for park, reverse, drive. Oh, come on, Ram, no. I knew they, they did this at one point, and they stopped, I think, and now they do it again. Damn. I don't like that. I like this though. 